Hello guys and welcome to another episode of iPig, the series where I play iPad games. And today we are playing Ridiculous Fishing. And this is an absolutely amazing game. I mean, fucking hell. I mean, look at this. Look at the pixels. Look at the music. Or hear the music, rather. Absolutely brilliant game. So here we go. This is Billy. Fantastic. He fishes like a champ. Tap the car. Uh, tap to cast the line. I shall. Tilt to avoid fish and try to get as deep as possible. So we're actually trying to avoid the fish at the moment. And uh, well, I didn't get too deep. Um, and then as we go up, we collect the fish. Sounds sounds pretty simple, right? Uh, not so simple actually. You actually now have to shoot the fish to pieces. <laughs> and uh, that's what makes this game so great. It is ridiculous fishing. So we we'll grab our gun. Let's get rid of some of these fish. And we get money for the more fish we shoot. Look at that. 60, 60 pounds. Fantastic. 60 pounds in the bank. And we caught two species. And uh, yeah, that's, that's basically this game. I'm probably going to do a little mini series on it. And uh, you can buy, you can buy whatever you want. So I think we're actually going to buy this next line from the. Oh, look at that! I never noticed that before. The little uh, Chinese man down there. He's got a sh the what? What do you call them? The like, straw hats, though. Uh. Oh, that's cool. God, I'm absolutely in love with this game. And what is that? Oh my God! This guy needs to his fingernails. My God. Rider. What? Oh my god, I think this is like a um <laughs> I think this is like a Twitter. Oh that's fantastic. Oh god, I love this. Okay, let's uh let's go fishing. Oh look at that little little seagull go past. And uh whilst we're fishing here, the guy that created this is called Vlambia, I think. Oh, I didn't get too deep there. And I think they actually have something to do with Mojang. If you, I remember watching the uh, Mojam a little while ago. And I'm pretty sure they were on it. Um, and yeah, I don't know. It's just a great game. And I think they do... I think they've created Super Crate Box. Which is another quite famous uh, indie game. And by the way, there'll be links to all what I'm mentioning down below. I'll put a link to um, the website for this game. And I'll put a link to Vlambeer's website if he's got one. I think that's how you say it. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Let's have a look in the store. See what we can get. Uh, a redneck hat. My god. Every fisherman should have a redneck hat. Of course they do. And look at this guy. He's got, he's got the perfect fisherman's beard. Let's see what our hat looks like. Oh, look at that. Oh my god. Do you know what it looks like? It looks like a Pokemon hat. Do you reckon we got to catch, catch them all? And I'm going to try and get a little bit deeper this time because I didn't do too well. And by the way, the controls are pretty simple. You just have to tilt and stuff. And again, I didn't get too far. Let's get this yellow one. Get that. Get that. Let's get that big one there. Oh, look. Look at this big one. Look at this big mother fucking... Get rid of that. Oh, that fish has gone flying. Oh, oh, careful, careful. There we go. 172 pounds. Look at that. Or dollars or whatever you want to call it. Store. Let's see what we can buy. And this is pretty much the whole entire game. But trust me, it's so much more fun. I've only played it for a little bit, by the way. I just um, reset the data on it so I could play it with you guys. 120 pounds. A chainsaw lure. Lure. Lure? How'd you say that? Lure. Uh, here we go. And this is where it starts to get really fun. Watch this. And this is actually as far as I've got, I think. My god. Here we go. Oh, my phone's ringing. Rod and Gunman. Love the new look. Oh, I suppose he's talking about my red hat. Well, thank you, uh... Jana Beeksman. I um I bought it for the very expensive price of two dollars and I do agree it makes me look 
magnificent Maddy Avin. Avin? Avian? Whatever. And uh, I need some fresh air. Smells like the old nest in here. Well, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm fishing though, so. And look at this. Tap and hold down to use the chainsaw. So I couldn't figure this out for a while. The chainsaw basically just allows you to go all the way through the fish and you get money for doing that. So basically what it means is you don't have to um you don't have to avoid the fish or whatever. And look at that turtle, should we get that? Here we go. Let's get that turtle, look at that. Big fish, big fish, big fish. Oh let's get a yellow one as well. And uh, what I was talking about, what I couldn't figure out is the um you see the well, actually, I can't show you now. You see the little three lines on the side of my screen, on the side of my iPad screen, uh, in the interface of the game. They are actually how long the chainsaw lasts for. It doesn't last forever. As in, it, like, runs out of boost. It's a permanent item, but it runs out of boost. And, oh, shit, we're losing quite a few fish here. Let's get rid of that turtle. How much money did we make there? $228. That was pretty good. And if you're wondering why the screen's a little bit blurry or whatever, it is because I'm playing on an iPad, of course, it's an iPad game in series. Um, so what it means is I've got to actually stream from my iPad to my computer and then screen record from the computer. Pretty crazy. Um, let's see, do we want a shotgun? Chick chick boom? Uh, I don't think we do, I think we want the Uzi to be honest. I'm going to save up a bit. And what do we need to move on to the next, um, the next ocean? I think we needed to, uh, I think we need to catch five species of fish. Oh. There we go. Oh, what happened there? Oh, I know. I'm such an idiot. I hit a fish, didn't I? Oh, well. $300. And, uh, I think what we do is... We shall try and get as far as we can today, and then I'll make this like a little mini series, and I'll just give you updates now and again. I think that'd be pretty cool. So, Uzi, no. Okay, let's make this the last time, and I shall end this episode. Just a short little episode for you today, guys, because I'm a busy guy. Let's chuck this chainsaw on, cut up some of these fish. And there's the pink little boost bar that you, um you might have seen me talking about earlier. And I accidentally turned the chainsaw off. Come on, let's get some of these big fish. Come on, I want fish and chips tonight. Here we go. Ugh. For God's sake, let's get a look at this. I need an Uzi. Definitely going to need an Uzi so I can just blow up these fish to freaking space. There we go. 140 pounds. Actually, do you know what I'm going to do? We play, we play this. We play in this episode till we get the Uzi and then, I'll, then I shall bid you farewell. Oh, here we go. Let's see if we can get a little bit further this time. Let's go around here. Around here. Here we go. Look at this. A lot more better this time. And here we go. Just turn the blender on. Get rid of all these big fish. Get rid of that. Oh, by the way, you don't want to hit the jellyfish uh, like I just did because they actually, um, they actually cause you to lose money, I think. Lose five money for each one that you hit. And whoop. Let's get that. Let's get some of these guys. This look at that, got an absolute shit ton of fish. Here we go, kablam kablam. And we're not gonna hit that squid actually, because it will actually lose us money. Look at all these flying fish, get rid of that turtle. Oh my god, look how high this one went. God, he's a flying fish. There we go, more money. There we go, we're gonna buy the Uzi. Here we go. Roll like a gangster, indeed. I'm a redneck gangster. God, never heard of that before, actually. And I think we're in the episode here. We quickly check what um people have got to say on the old timeline. Yippee ki yay, mother father. That's very true. Gwen. Oh, look, Gwen's not happy about that language. Indeed, indeed, salty. Oh, <laughs> salty. Very good. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next episode where we should continue playing. I might have progressed a little bit and we're, we're trying to fire the old Uzi everywhere. So I hope you enjoyed that little episode and I shall see you again next time.